Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, and even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. As always, if you're already subscribed, thanks again so much for being here and welcome back. I hope that you all had a fantastic holiday and that you're enjoying this week leading up to the new year that I know we're all looking forward to. I have announced my final hidden giveaway for the month of December to thank you all for your continued support. That giveaway will be open until the channel hits 2,500 subscribers, so you definitely have some time to go back through the videos and find that hidden giveaway. Today, though, I have a familiar box here on the channel, and that is Anchor of Hope. It's kind of a lifestyle box. For $36 per month, you always get three items that are often handmade by survivors of human trafficking or refugees, so it is definitely a box with a cause. If you do a three-month subscription, it actually brings it down to $33 a month because it's just $99. And you can save 10% on any subscription or purchase even in their online shop using my code, which is Noelle10. As always, I will leave all of that information for you in the description box below. This month's box didn't come in their usual one, which is usually a very beautiful blue box with some florals on it. This time it just kind of came like in a gift box, and I think that's because one of the items that they did do a spoiler of over on Instagram is a little bit of a different size so it probably just didn't fit in their regular box but I'm sure that they will be back to their regular box very very soon and I do really love it I just think it's so pretty um, so I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and we'll see what we've got so inside we've got some maroon tissue paper usually it's teal maybe that was for the holidays this did actually arrive before Christmas I just am finally getting to filming this video and then inside we always have a nice little product card on one side it tells you a little bit more about their mission, who they are, who they serve, and then on the other side they do tell you a little bit about the items, where they come from, some kind of artisan stories if they have the opportunity. I always like to read at least one of the paragraphs though just in case this is the first time you've ever seen this subscription. So it says who we are. We are a subscription box company that commissions refugees, survivors of human trafficking, and others in vulnerable situations to make handmade items. Through the dignity of work these individuals are able to rebuild damaged and fragile lives as they work to overcome the painful situations that have brought them to this place. As we embarked on this adventure, aiming only to provide an income for these precious families, we saw something greater start to happen. Through the relationships that have been building, we see the power of community happen. As people all over the world desire and purchase these handmade items, we see hope arising and it is a beautiful thing. So again, I just love that mission. I'm going to go ahead and set the card up in front of me so that I can reference it as we go through our three items for the month of December. So so the first one is just a sweet little ornament made out of felt and you can kind of see the handmade quality. This is adorable. I got a white one. There's probably some color variations I'm guessing across the boxes. So if you are subscribed, let me know in the comments below what color your art ornament was. Maybe it wasn't even a heart. Let's see what it says about this. This is a survivor made ornament. This beautiful ornament is made by trafficking survivors in Bangladesh who are working hard to create better futures for themselves and their children. Poverty is one of the greatest risk factors for trafficking in Bangladesh and around the world. Making quality work and education programs like the one these ornaments are made through an invaluable resource for survivors. So again, I just love hearing that story behind it and knowing that my money is going towards a good cause. All right, let's go into the next item already. So this one came all wrapped up in a little box on its own. And this, I believe, was also spoiled over on Instagram. So definitely check it out. They usually let you know. And what are two of the items? I think sometimes once it gets later in the month, once you would have had to have already purchased the box, they finally do like kind of a full reveal. So I'm always usually really excited. There's sometimes I like all three items. Sometimes it's like two out of three. Um, but again, because of the mission of Anchor of Hope, I do really enjoy staying subscribed. So this is a beautiful raw ruby necklace on a silver chain. And it looks like a nice length for me. It's kind of a chunkier chain, but I do think this is really pretty. It's like that deep, deep ruby color. And it's kind of cool because it is a raw uncut ruby. It says this beautiful raw ruby 
rough cut ruby necklace is made by our own anchor of hope box artisans each necklace helps provide for our artisans and their families a group made up of local women who have been rescued from trafficking and refugees who have relocated from around the world your support is providing hope and joy this holiday season so i love this i've gotten a few jewelry pieces from anchor of hope and they've always been very sweet and very simple and you guys some of you who i know love silver way more than gold will be happy to see we did get a silver variation this just kind of reminds me there's one time when i was in india and i wanted to buy this raw ruby ring and i decided not to because it was just a little bit out of my budget and it's been one of those experiences where i learned not to have those like shopping regrets when i'm somewhere in a foreign country and i just really want to have something to remember that trip with so i always think of a, a rubies as a signal of having no regrets and really getting all of the things that are going to remind you of a fantastic trip so i kind of feel like this is my like replacement ruby and i just think it's really sweet it'd be great like as a layering necklace and it's definitely great for like daytime just a nice little accent a really deep beautiful color and again i do love that it is made by the anchor of hope artisans all right we've got one more beautiful item this one is not wrapped up this is a mango wood tray and this is actually really nice it's like a nice size you could definitely use it to store like outgoing or incoming letters um, my husband definitely needs all kinds of valets because I feel like all the stuff that comes out of his pockets winds up all over whatever surface is in the house so it's kind of nice to kind of contain them with these little trays it's probably something you could use to like serve like a little hors d'oeuvre as well it does have some felt feet on the bottom so that is nice or kind of rubbery feet so it's not going to scratch anything but it is pretty smooth there's definitely like a gloss on it so I do appreciate that and I do think mango is just a really really pretty wood grain so it says this lightweight tray is made by young women rescued from sex trafficking in India through a program that spreads awareness and works to eradicate trafficking through prevention, intervention, and aftercare. This tray will make the perfect catch-all at your door or in your kitchen to serve as a daily reminder of survivors around the world. So again, I think this is beautiful. It's pretty like neutral in terms of like style. So I think it would work in anyone's home somewhere at least. Let me know in the comments below what you would use this beautiful mango wood tray for. For. and I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please do give it a thumbs up and hopefully I see you all very very soon in my next unboxing